Hey, it's KMA. How's your day today? And welcome to the corner. And today we're doing something a little bit different. We're doing Forever Stranded Lost Souls. Um, so I'm just gonna create a world real quick, and I'll tell you about it. Um, we'll just call it Lost Soul. Lost Soul. Um, because it's gonna take a minute for this to load in, and probably with my resource pack, it'll probably take a little bit longer. So, I am Mr. Vanilla. I do not play mod Minecraft usually, and this is going to be my first expose into modded Minecraft that I'm going to really delve into. It. I've learned a little Tinker's Construct in the past, but other than that, I really do not know what I am doing. So, this is going to be a learning experience for me, and I know the people who know mods are going to like yell at me through the video and go you know you, you idiot you dirt you you gotta do it like this and i just be like i don't know because i don't know anything about this stuff so i am gonna learn as i go and you're just gonna have to be a little bit patient with some of my stupidities because there will be plenty of those and uh it should be interesting because it should be interesting come on load up load up Immersive engineering. Warning, you're Java. Okay, I just won't use immersive engineering. Uh, aroma backup world. Okay, let's uh, bring up the map. Okay, I already. Okay, cool. My settings are already set up. I uh, changed, came in here to do um, a little video, and it didn't look right because I had the. Um, I had this. The uh, lighting on smooth, no, not smooth. What is it called? Moody. And you know, you couldn't see anything. So I'm doing this for a second time, this first video at least. And uh, so I've been in here and um, upgraded the map. I made the larger icons, got rid of the grid, and did things like that, you know, like uh, show where I'm heading and stuff like that. So, Lost Souls, we are here and we are in the nether, which is my least favorite place in all of the minecraft world the nether i hate it i despise it so why am i torturing myself with this let's just end this right now and just start another series okay yeah all right so we are on like uh, some sort of ship with some interesting blocks nether utilities spawn point okay chiseled chiseled stuff I don't really know what this is. I have uh, looked around because I did record this video once before. Uh, so I kind of know what to expect for this first video because I did record about a half hour. And I know that there's apples in here. How do I get them? There we go. Let's get the sword. We get the, the little the mess of crafting. And we get a quest updated. This mod is a quest based thing. And I kind of rather like that because it will be a great way for me to learn how to um, learn how to mod, do modded stuff. So, uh, quest, ouchies. Uh, uh, there we go. If we click over here, enabled hardcore, complete. If you don't click claim, the pack will stay in normal mode and you will have infinite lives. If you claim the quest, it will be hardcore and you will only have five lives. Good luck, you're gonna need it. Well, guess what? I don't know mod, so I am gonna be a wimp and I am gonna say, thank you, I'm not gonna do hardcore. No, 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 no. The quest is full for updates of packs. Okay, we don't have any updates, so we don't have to do this. So pack, what's this? Reload loot. We don't need to reload any loot. So basically, starting off. This is where you start off. Within this pack, there are many things changed to make survival a lot harder. Follow the quests to help you along the way. So, let's see what we need to do first. And look at this. There is this... <sighs> Alright, let me get my reading glasses out. Mm-hmm. After escaping the treacherous heat of the vast desert planet on your last adventure, which I did not do, 
<laughs> this is actually a sequel to another modded quest thing called Lost Cities, I think it was called. I didn't do that. I think I watched Etho do it. I'm pretty sure it was Etho. I think that's what he played. But anyways, enough of that. I didn't do it, so I, um, I did not have the last adventure. You got the ship up and running again. While using the hyperdrive to venture into uncharted space, you thought all was fine and dandy until... Siren shot off, piercing your brain like a sharp dagger. You stumbled over to the control panel to find out what the issue was and noticed that the... Uh-oh, damn hyperdrive had went into meltdown. With a wrench in hand, you rush over to the hyperdrive core and try to fix any part of it that you can. But you are too late. The ship shook violently, causing all sorts of mechanical problems with no hope left. Your survival instincts had kicked in and urged you to try and use the working engine power to thrust your way out. That's some major power there. The engines roared and threw the ship off course, plummeting the vessel out of, the, out of hyperspace and into a black hole. With low engine power and time needed to fix the hyperdrive, you had given up and let the abyss of the black hole determine your fate, thus turning on the autopilot while you continued to tinkle with the hyperdrive tinkle. <laughs> No, we're not going to tinkle on the hyperdrive. We're going to tinker with the hyperdrive. And you know, if I went through a black hole, there would be a singularity problem and I would not exist. So I'm sorry. This could this is fantasy already. The ship began shaking violently once more, throwing your body into the sail and knocking you out cold. Luckily, the autopilot had done its job and managed to land the ship safely on a nearby world. You rise from your slumber to the smell of foreign burn, burning gases, the sounds of faint screams, and the concept that you are in hell, which is not a good place to be. Hell. Hell ain't a bad place to be. Sorry. Enough with the ACDC. Stepping out of your ship, you look around and you notice that you are not quite in hell, but you might as well be. It might be a good time to hang up the keys to flying ships and work on getting a proper piloting license because you are apparently the worst pilot in the galaxy. Oh, well, thank you. Good thing I drive much better than I pilot. Hmm, I guess. From here on out, you're on your own. You, ooh, look at that grammatical error, guys. You are on your own. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Grammar police. Death. Why? Uh, that's okay. I do that, too, when I'm in a hurry. It's like, whatever. Gather the materials needed to survive and rebuild. Wow, two and two sentences. But anyways, gravel is needed for the most basic of tools, and I'm not ragging on them for doing that. Um, by pointing that out. And this is an awesome pack. I watched Hypnotize do this, um, some of it. I haven't watched the whole series because I decided after watching a couple of the episodes that I wanted to kind of think about doing this myself. So, the first task and starting off, I need six piles of gravel and two normal gravel things. So, let's get out of here. Let us um, roam around. This is our ship. Let's close the door. We don't want to. All right. And we'll throw that over there. We'll get everything set. Now, certain things. I don't know what that is. Bobbles. Hmm. All right. Certain things here. We have skills. Mining, gathering, attack, defense, building, farming, agility, and magic. And how to upgrade these skills is through your experience points. So right now I have no experience. So in order for me to gain one more mining, I guess, I need three experience points. And the reason why that is like that is because certain things, you need a certain amount of skill to actually um, use them because I don't want you to go like ahead of schedule and all that wonderful stuff. So follow the cursor, KMA. Eh? Yes, follow, oh, up there, over here. Go, go get your cursor, cursor, cursor. Yes. Okay. Let's quarrel. Let me get back to this job at hand. And I hear that there is a thingy majiggy up there. A squishy thing that's making squishy sounds. Um, and over here, because I, I did this recording already once, <laughs> these are like little storage areas. Uh, there's four of them. All of them have a little lever, lever, and none of them have anything worthy in them. So, what we have to do is get some gravel. So let's go out <laughs> into hell and uh, get some gravel. 
And um, let's see, I'm looking at my map up there. It looks like, is that a pig? Whoa. Oh man, I think these things with the, all the, yeah, there we go. I think the things with all the uh, particle effects are like super massive, whatever. All right, and here we go. I got the leggings, it says, I do not meet the requirements to use this item. So what's that? I don't know, five something and three something else. We'll figure that out at some point. Let's get this off my bar so I don't have to worry about that. Actually, you know what? I probably would want to keep this. So let's put this into the nice place to keep it for later, for a rainy day. Close the box. I don't like the fact that that's silent. I don't know if it's supposed to be. Is there any noise? Hmm. Oh, not at all. All right. So, um, we have got, you see to my left over, I'm looking right at it, right there, there's a blaze of some sort, and I think it's the real super duper blaze guy that is really scary, that likes to eat me and kill me, because, um, that's how I died, and the first time I recorded this was this stupid place. Um, and I'm afraid of him. Yes, I'm literally afraid of him because, yeah. Where are you? Oh, there's that. So where, where's the place? Let me. Oh, wait. It, it, it despawned. Oh, excellent. All right. So, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put out these fires because fires are bad. That's why I don't like none of them. I don't like the nether because you burn and burning is not fun. Well, not this type of burning. All right. And also, I, I found out the first time playing this, this, this thing right here will catch you on fire. If you break it, it will catch you on fire. If you stand on it, it will catch you on fire. But these, they don't. So let's uh, just truck the fire. And uh, should I go after that? I think I, I'm going to go after that, um, what do you call that thing? Are you telling me that I used durability on my sword? Oh, no, no, that's right. I killed something else. I was going to say, I used durability on the sword, but what now? Fires? What's going on? That's not right. All right. Oh, I'm looking right at another one of those suckers. Oh, this, this should be interesting. Let me, let me get this. What is that now? I don't know. Did it give me... Oh, what is this? Equestatum? Oh my god. Cinerous spore. Equism? Okay. Whatever. So, oh, the guy... Hmm. The guy decided to despawn again. This this guy... Oh, no. Wait, wait. He's right there. Wait, I see him. I'm gonna try it. Can I... Yeah, I can punch this... Right, right now. Here's some gravel. Come on, where are you? Where are you? I'm looking right at you, but I don't see you. Okay. I hear you? No. Okay, I'm gonna get this gravel. And let me, let me go back to the ship real quick. Well, actually, let me kill this guy. Let me make sure there's nothing like really around here that's gonna kill me while I try and kill this guy. Like, um, these guys, oh, come on. Fire, bye, fire. Come here, come here, little doggy. Come here. Come on, come on. You know you want it. You know you want it, little guy. You little ugly guy. Little ugly. Yeah, little ugly. Aha, monster hunter. Aw, I only got two of them. It's in a confined area. Oh, what what's beating me? Oh, another one of these particle things. Okay. Those things tend to sneak up on you, but they're pretty easy to kill, I've noticed. Even the overpowered ones, so I'm not too worried about it. As I try and destroy my ship with my sword. Alright, this is not bad. I can handle this. Alright. And there is... Look at all this XP. Yes, yes, sorry. Alright, so... Let me go back to the ship and do what I was going to do. So now I have 4 XP, which is pretty cool. Let me go in. Ha! So, what was I going to do? I was going to go into mod options. I'm going to 
Or X Vita. I just wanna make sure. Hmm, no, this isn't where I need to look. Wait, let's see. Oh, you know what I need to do? It's not there, it's controls. I wanna make sure I got the vein. Mina, I don't know I if I have to change it every time I come in here. Probably not, but Rav. Rav. So uh excavate is Grov. Shape toggle, I don't know what that means, but Grov. It's so Grov. It's Grov. Oh, bravo. Alright. Back to the game. Ooh, this is weird sounds. Let's put the extra stuff we do not need in here for now. And we're gonna go and get the rest of the gravel. The pile of coal dust. Yay. Yes. Magma. Alright. So there's that. Let's go and get some more gravel because we gotta finish this quest. We got six pounds of gravel. Now we need um, more gravel and I found out and I'll just do it the way I found out. I'll just show you exactly what I did the first time I played this. Which is E gravel. Oh come on. <laughs> a little little laggy there. A little laggy. Oh what's this? Biomaker gravel beach. Okay. Gravel. Gra there we go. So four piles of gravel makes one gravel. So that's what we need. We need to make two more gravel, and we only have six, so let's, you know, we've got one. We can't even make two things of gravel, so we have to get a little bit more gravel, and that's how I'm basically going to figure out these things. I'm just going to search it in the JEI, right? That's what that thing's called. And uh, I'm going to get the gravel. So, yes, it's, it's already looking a little safer out here. I will clean out the rest of the um, fires soon. Yeet! Is that a hole? No, okay. There is more gravel over here and an enderman. So let's try out this. Um, let's try out Grav. No, that's not Grav. <laughs> Bane Miner! Ah, oh, there we go. All right. Yes, that's going to be dangerous for me later on. So I probably have a lot of gravel now. Yeah, I got a ton of gravel. Um. And that looks like a fortress, which I saw last time. Enderman over there. All right. And there's some weird blocks. I don't know what these blocks are. That's, that looks like a diamond, nether diamond door. Don't know what nether diamond ore is, but we'll probably find out at some point soon. So let us get the rest of this place a little bit safer um, with the flames. <laughs> I do not like flames. Oh, and look at that. Options. Better FPS option. No, 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 no. Controls. Auto jump off. I don't like the fact that auto jump is default on. I switched so many versions of Minecraft so much that a little that I uh, I always have auto jump on by accident. There's probably a mod to fix that, but I don't care. I don't mind. I'm not lazy. I can I can go into a menu. What was the What the Ouch That did not happen to me before. I think I just got my butt blown up. I'm like I hear I hear a pressure plate. And I guess the pressure plate went to something that blew me up. Oh my god. I gotta be a little more careful. I guess that was not cool. That was not cool. Dare you do that? You blew me up. Hmm. Alright. So, well, we'll know. It's kind of like the fire swamp in the uh, Princess Bride. You hear the tunk, 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 tunk. You know, the duck and cover because... The fire is going to come. So when I hear the pressure plate, I'm going to be like, oh, something's going to blow up. Let's not stand on this anymore and let's evacuate the area as fast as possible. Uh, don't know what those are. They look like clouds, so probably some sort of cloud thing. Enderman! Let's not look at the Enderman. 
I, I'm just so picky with fires in the nether that I just need to clean all oh, this stuff. So, uh oh, another one, another one, another one, another one. <sighs> you jerk. You jerk. Jerk face. <clears throat> um, that puts a. I don't even have a. Oh man. Well, at least I can break another rack with my fists. Alright. <laughs> We're just gonna pretend that did not happen. Alright. That did not happen, guys. You saw nothing there. There's nothing to see there. Nothing at all. Alright. Let's get out of here. I'm afraid I'm gonna blow myself up some more. <laughs> uh, we heard that noise, the pressure plate noise, and we ran like the dickens, and we survived. All right. Weirdness. Uh, there's some more fires over there. So let's go uh, put out those little fires. And we're going to um, basically uh, do the quest and get out of here. Because I, I, this is just kind of like the introductory video for this series. What, 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 what? Okay. I didn't think these lit me on fire. It's that sucker. Okay, get away, get away. All right. Now, let's... Ooh. Oh, okay. He despawned again. Keep seeing the, the blaze. Um, like I said, the first time I played this, the blaze killed me. It was not cool. And I'm afraid of those blaze. It's like a blaze that wears a leather tunic, and it's just like... <laughs> That's why I don't like the nether! Mm -hmm. So, let's go uh, play with our gravel. Let's go hide where it's nice and comfy. Well, I don't know if it's nice and comfy in here, but okay. Let's us make another thing a gravel, and that should complete the quest. Quest completed. See, that's how easy it is. Even I, Mr. Vanilla, <laughs> can do a quest in modded minecraft <laughs> amazing so uh how do i claim the uh -huh. this is how i claim it choice rewards uh choice 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 i want that choice i like the loot in the chest let's see okay so th that unlocks a couple of more things but we are going you know, to looking look into that in the next episode but let us open up our chest. I think we have a chest in us. Yes. I... Oh, how did I get coal? Oh, that's nice. All right. Ding. Ooh, like I'm going to be able to use this stuff. I don't even... I've never... Wait. I have watched some modded series, and I've heard of transfer node and transfer pipe, and I kind of know what it does. I think this sucks material out of a container, and this is what... The material goes through after it gets sucked out of the container i think but i don't need that right now i'd rather have food so let's put our stuff away um bent fiber i got those from the um the black plants outside oh i don't know what 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 I... oh okay because i have so much I'm running out of space. I can't put it. What? What? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I got some soul sand too. But guys, that is going to do it for episode number one. As you can tell, I'm a derp. I don't know what I'm doing. So this should be hella interesting. So I will see you next time on episode two next Monday. Have a good one. Goodbye.